Northern Europe may be known as a place of Vikings and snow and to some extent, that's not incorrect. The Viking Age definitely did help to shape the culture of Scandinavia. And yes, there is a lot of snow, too. But it's much more refined and much more beautiful than you could imagine. From the storied, colorful old towns of some of the region's richest trading cities to museums stressing the importance of the ancient Vikings, history comes to life in Northern Europe. In this video, we explore the best places to visit in Northern Europe. We've collected a list of the top places to visit in Northern Europe, so make sure to include them in your list if you're a visitor. At first in the list, number one, fjords of Norway. Norway is famous for its glacier-formed, U-shaped valleys that everybody knows and loves as fjords. Sonefjord may be its longest and deepest cutting over 1,300 meters below sea level as well as the country's most famous, but it's the sheer amount of fjords that make the Norwegian coast what it is. There's possibly the world's strongest tidal current at Saltstraumen. Sorfjorden is a particularly dramatic subfjord of Hardangerfjorden. The mountain backdrop at Tafjorden is amazing. There have even been fjordo coral reefs found at depths of 50 to 100 meters. Number 2. Vatnajokull National Park Vatnajokull National Park is the result of merging two extant Icelandic national parks, Jokulsugljöfur and Skaftafell, with the giant ice cap that is Vatnajokull itself. As such, there are some incredible natural sights to see here. Witnessing the water of the wide Jokulsa Eif Jalam falling an impressive 44 meters from one of the many hiking trails is awe-inspiring. Elsewhere, there's the caldera of Askja, where you'll find the turquoise geothermal lake of Viti. Simply driving the ring road of this national park is an excellent way to watch nature unfold. Number 3. Lapland. Except for the North Pole, there's nowhere more northerly that's as famous as this place. Lapland is a place for big kids and little kids alike. Call him what you like Father Christmas, Santa Claus, Saint Nicholas this is his, traditional, home. Head to Rovaniemi to see if you can find his workshop. Otherwise, Lapland straddling the northern reaches of both Sweden and Finland is the home of another traditional resident, the Sami people. Also known as Sapmi, Lapland is home to the original ice hotel, skiing opportunities, and chances to glimpse the northern lights. Number 4. Lofoten Islands, an archipelago extending from the northeast coast of Norway. Lofoten provides some truly dramatic natural backdrops for your travel adventures. One of the most famous things about Lofoten, besides its beautifully scenic setting, is its climate. It's known for being strangely warm for its latitude. Back to the nature now. Keen rock climbers and mountaineers should make a beeline for Moskonesoya, while cyclists can enjoy a well-marked and particularly stunning cycle path from Southerly A, which goes on past Fiskeball in the north. Otherwise, Lofoten is a warren of charming fishing villages with breathtaking natural surroundings like Nussjord on Flaxtadoya. Number 5. Gullfoss. In southwest Iceland lies the startling natural wonder that is Gullfoss. Meaning, Golden Falls, in Icelandic, this waterfall is anything but ordinary. The Hvida River, originating at the Langjokull Glacier, runs its course through a canyon and then suddenly turns at a sharp angle to plunge 32 meters down its two stages before continuing. The sheer power of nature here is easy to see. Visit in summer for the full effect, when 140 cubic meters tumble down the falls every second. Number 6. Svalbard Far, far north from the Norwegian mainland is the island archipelago of Svalbard. Set well into the Arctic Circle, this far-flung destination is the place to come to witness the phenomenon that is midnight sun. During the summer, the sun doesn't set here never properly falling below the horizon for 24 hours. Unfortunately, the opposite is also true of winter, when the sun never rises. Not part of Norway until 1925, today, visiting Svalbard is relatively easy, thanks to a surprising number of lodgings. This makes it easy to spot everything from polar bears and arctic foxes to the magical northern lights. Number 7. Blue Lagoon the hot spring that is Blue Lagoon is an extremely popular spot. Set on the Reykjanes Peninsula, not all that far from the Icelandic capital, the turquoise waters almost seem to glow like a gem amid the black volcanic rocks surrounding it. 
The Blue Lagoon boasts 39 degrees Celsius water temperatures all year round, as well as healing properties. Not naturally formed, it was first established in the 1970s as part of the cooling system for the local geothermal power plant. People started bathing here in the 80s, and it has since attracted people the world over. Number 8. Faroe Islands Set in the North Atlantic Ocean around 200 miles from the coast of Scotland, the Faroe Islands are made up of 18 craggy, volcanic islets and islands. Its capital of Torsham, located on the island of Strema, is where around 40% of the population of this self-governing territory live. Many of the islands are connected by tunnels, bridges, causeways, and ferry crossings. It's a popular spot for bird watchers especially, who enjoy observing the many species of seabird that live there, such as puffins, fulmers, kittiwakes, and guillemots. Number 9. Jotunheimen National Park Part of the Scandinavian mountain range, Jotunheimen is a collection of mountains in Norway that boasts 29 of the country's tallest peaks. Around a third of the mountains are contained within the Jotunheimen National Park. The area is a very popular spot for anybody looking for adventures on mountainsides namely hikers and climbers. In winter, the slopes are covered in pure white powder, while in the summer, Jotunheimen is all about grassy valleys and gleaming rivers and skiing, thanks to the summer ski center. At last in the list, number 10, Finnish Lakeland. Finnish Lakeland is a region in the east of Finland where, true to its name, you will find almost countless lakes, around 40 lakes per 100 square kilometers. The largest of these is Lake Saima, which is not only Finland's biggest lake, but also the fourth largest natural lake in the whole of Europe. Studying Saima like little jewels are its 5,484 islands. After spending time in an oak-burning sauna, a cooling dip in a lake is the best thing to do. The water of the lake is beautifully clean and reflects the sky for even more charm. Now it's time to hear from you what's your favorite places to visit in Northern Europe. Is there something we missed? Let us know in the comments section below. And don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe to Greenable if you haven't already clicked the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.